My name is Anthony Bongiorni, um, owner and operator of the Floyd Patterson Boxing Club. The main reason that I didn't name the gym anything other than the Floyd Patterson Boxing Club was because of our history. Um, Floyd's son, or Coach Patterson's son, Tracy, who himself is a former two-time world champion, as well as a New York State Boxing Hall of Famer, um, was my best friend when I first came up here from the city. So I would go around to the gym and, and we became really, really close. And, you know, we decided when, when Coach Patterson passed away in 2006 to open up the gym in 2015 for the simple reason that there was a void left. I've been boxing for about a year now. Uh, what made me get into boxing was I always wanted to pursue, I always like combat sports and I always wanted to pursue it. I would recommend boxing for others because it definitely boosts your confidence. Even if you're not like sparring or fighting, if you come in, you hit a heavy bag, you start doing mitt work, you definitely get better and you see it in yourself. You start to feel better, you look better, and you just feel more confident in yourself. My name is Derek Olhoff and uh, I've been around boxing since 1994. I started competing from 1995 until 2008 in the amateurs and then right after my uh, last amateur fight I started coaching so I've been coaching ever since 2008. So I like coaching because uh, sometimes I get more excitement out of watching them fight and win than I ever did when I was fighting and uh, each individual has their own path to success and I like to develop each individual on their own basis. My job as a boxing coach is to teach these kids how to not have to use their fist, how to be able to use their mind first and be able to differentiate when it's time to for self-defense and when it's time to walk away. See, there's a big difference between fighting and self-defense. I teach my kids to defend themselves only if they have to, but more so teach them the discipline that it takes to be able to walk away from a situation. When I first came in, I was like 35 pounds heavier. So I lost a lot of weight. That's like a motivation. It's like a workout. For, well, it is a workout. Here it's fun. I don't mind it. It's a good way to pass time. And I just enjoy doing it. As far as for boxing for women, I recommend it because, uh, believe it or not, uh, most men when they come in here, they, they already know everything. But women, for some reason, come in and they really learn and they, they pay more attention to detail and technique, so sometimes they progress a little better. I've had a, a female uh, Metro champion here, and I will also uh, train a, a young girl that was a, a junior Olympic champion and now is a professional undefeated MMA fighter. We've had women win the New York Metros. Uh, which is a prestigious tournament in New York City. Uh, we actually have a former Junior Olympic champion out of our gym, um, Fatima Klein, who uh, you know represented the Junior Olympics and won it under our banner. So, for people that think that you know women should only just stay in conditioning and do kickboxing or whatever, you know they're, they're, they're highly mistaken. It's, it's really been a, a the sport has really grown through actually having women fighters participate.